Electrical safety. 1. The most dangerous place to use electrical equipment is A. Indoors B. Outdoors C. Near water D. Near other electrical equipment Answer is C. Near water 2. You discover the electrical cord on a drill has been damaged and some of the cord's insulation is missing. You should A. Wrap tape around the damaged spot to prevent electrical shocks. B. Check to see if the drill still works. C. Tag the drill out of service and notify the department responsible for equipment maintenance. D. Make sure that the cord does not come in contact with the floor. Answer is, C. Tag the drill out of service and notify the department responsible for equipment maintenance. 3. The safest ladder to use around electricity is? A. Wood. B. Fiberglass. C. Aluminum. D. A step stool. Answer is, B. Fiberglass. 4. The earth, water, concrete and the human body are all conductors of electricity. A. True. B. False. Answer is, A. True. 5. The effects of an electrical shock on the body depend upon all of the following. Except. A. Current. B. Path. C. Duration. D. Body weight. Answer is, D. Body weight. 6. Injuries from electricity can include which of the following? A. Electric shock that may or may not result in electrocution. B. Falls. C. Burns. D. All of the above. Answer is, D. All of the above. 7. Open knockouts on outlet boxes. A. Must be reported and repaired as soon as possible. B. Are permitted by assure. C. Are common because replacing knockouts is expensive. D. Pose no hazard as the electrical wiring has been rerouted. Answer is, A. Must be reported and repaired as soon as possible. 8. Which of the following is acceptable by OSHA standards? A. An unqualified employee flipping tripped breakers in a breaker box. B. Plugging an extension cord into a second extension core. C. Removing a ground pin if needed to plug into a two-prong outlet. D. A qualified person repairing an extension core. Answer is, D. A qualified person repairing an extension core. 9. Flexible cords can be used in the workplace. A. As a substitute for permanent wiring. B. If they are run behind walls to reduce the chance of abrasion and damage. C. If heavy or extra heavy duty cords are needed for temporary purposes. D. If any obvious splices are repaired with electrical tap. Answer is, C. If heavy or extra heavy duty cords are needed for temporary purposes. 10. It is the responsibility of all employees to understand and use electrical safety every day. A. True. B. False. Answer is, A. True. 11. On which of the following routine tests are conducted? A. 
Oil circuit breakers. B. Air blast circuit breakers. C. Minimum oil circuit breakers. D. All of the above. Answer is D. All of the above. 12. SF6 gas. A. Is yellow in color. B. Is lighter than air. C. Is non toxic. D. Has pungent small. E. None of the above. Answer is C. Is non toxic. 13. Which of the following medium is employed for extinction of AC in air circuit breaker? A. Water. B. Oil. C. Air. D. SF6. Answer is C. Air. 14. With which of the following, a circuit breaker must be equipped for remote operation? A. Inverse time trip. B. Time delay trip. C. Shunt trip. D. None of the above. E. All of the above. Answer is, C. Shunt trip. 15. Fault diverters are basically. A. Fuses. B. Relays. C. Fast switches. D. Circuit breakers. Answer is, C. Fast switches. 16. A thermal protection switch can protect against. A. Short circuit. B. Temperature. C. Overload. D. Over voltage. Answer is C. Overload. 17. Arc in a circuit behaves as A. A capacitive reactance. B. An inductive reactance. C. A resistance increasing with voltage rise across the arc. D. A resistance decreasing with voltage rise across the arc. Answer is, D. A resistance decreasing with voltage rise across the arc. 18. Thermal circuit breaker has. A. Delayed trip action. B. Instantaneous drip action. C. Both of the above. D. None of the above. Answer is A. Delayed trip action. 20. Overload relays are of type A. Induction. B. Solid state. C. Thermal. D. Electromagnetic. E. All above. Answer is, E. All above. 21. Thermal overload relays are used to protect the motor against overcurrent due to A. Short circuits. B. Heavy loads. C. Grounds. D. All of the above. Answer is, B. Heavy loads. 22. Magnetic circuit breaker has drip action. A. Delayed. B. Instantaneous. C. Both of the above. D. None of the above. Answer is, B. Instantaneous. 23. Shunt relays are made of. A few turns of thin wire b few turns of thick wire c many turns of thin wire d many turns of thick wire answer is c many turns of thin wire 24 the relay operating speed depends upon a the spring tension b 
the rate of flux built up. C. Armature core air gap. D. All of the above. Answer is D. All of the above. 25. In order that current should flow without causing excessive heating or voltage drop, the relay contacts should A. Have low contact resistance. B. Be clean and smooth. C. Be of sufficient size and proper shape. D. Have all above properties. Answer is D. Have all above properties. Please give comment and suggestions. Thank you. Subscribe our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for more updates. Thank for visit our channel. See you next class. Thank you.